Hello and welcome to this new Animal Wise video. Today we'll be talking about one of the most popular Melosa dog breeds in the world, the Boxer. The ancestors of the Boxer are two German Melosa breeds, the Bullenbeiser and the Berenbeiser. However, most of the Boxer's genetic charge comes from the smallest Bullenbeiser variety from Brabant in Belgium. These were hunting dogs, resilient, strong and with a great prey drive. Over time, they were crossbred with the English Bulldog and started to be used to herd cattle. The official breed standard for the Boxer was set in 1894. The origin of the breed's name is unknown. At first, it was thought that it was a reference to their skill with their forelegs. But nowadays, it is believed that Boxer is a corruption of the name Boxel, which was a nickname for the Brabant Bullenbreiser. Boxers are medium-sized dogs. Females are usually smaller, at 53 to 59 centimeters, or 17 to 23 inches, to the withers, and 25 kilograms or 55 pounds in weight. On the other hand, males are 57 to 63 centimeters or 22 to 25 inches tall and weigh more than 30 kilograms or 66 pounds. There is only one official boxer breed, but they are usually divided into two types, the European boxer, more slender, and the American boxer, more muscular. They can come in basically any colour, from pale cream to deep red fawn or brindle. They can have white markings or not, but they always have a black mask. Among their most notable traits, we can find their heavy and powerful head, their droopy lips and their deep chest. Their excellent sense of smell and their bravery have made boxers very popular and reliable assistants for firefighters and police forces. They are loyal, vigilant and active, as well as docile and loyal to their family. They can be good companions to children, although they can be rough players, even if they always mean well. Boxers are also protective and watchful. Boxers need two or three daily walks, which should include moderate physical exercise to keep their muscles in good shape. It's important that they get a balanced, monitored diet to prevent weight problems and nutritional deficiencies. You must care for your boxer's hygiene daily, removing roam and drool, and you must check and clean their ears and nails at least once every month. You should bathe your dog every month or two, depending on how dirty they get, and brush them once a week to remove dead hair. Use a brush with short, soft bristles. Since boxers develop very deep bonds with their owners, they will enjoy games and learning obedience commands, even if the learning process takes more time than with other breeds. It's very important to socialize them with other dogs, animals and people as soon as possible. Once a boxer puppy gets their vaccines, you can go out together and get to know other sociable dogs. You should also work on basic obedience, teaching your dog commands such as sit down, stay or heal, which will be key to their safety. You must be careful with extreme temperatures and intense exercise, because Melosa breeds like the Boxer often have difficulty breathing, which can lead to a heat stroke. They are also prone to cancer, and to a lesser extent to heart conditions, hip dysplasia and epilepsy. Other risks are gastric torsion and food allergies. Their skin is delicate, and if they don't have a comfortable bed, or if they have to stay outdoors for long periods, they can suffer from calluses on their knees. Boxers need a comfortable warm space to rest inside their home. You must also keep their vaccination schedule up to date, as well as deworming them regularly. A boxer's life expectancy is about 10 years, but a happy and well cared for dog can live to 13 or even 15. This is it for today. If you enjoyed this video, hit the like button and subscribe to our channel. See you soon!